everybody to the Fairfield internship video. My name's Emma Farnworth and I'm assistant head teacher at college. I oversee the internship as well. So the internship has now been running for a couple of years and it's been really successful in finding our students employment, moving into supported living, learning how to drive and you'll be able to see another video link which is attached to this email which will share with you some of the successes of our previous students. The internship is open to year 13 and 14 Inspire, so this is why you'll have got this link. It is based in a classroom at Fairfield Hospital where students have their own space and they can go back there in the, at lunchtime and eat the lunch or they can go and get the lunch um, and they group there and have a lesson in the morning and then they go off and do some work. The pastoral support is very similar to Elms Bank. Rachel will be there to support them with their, any needs that their students have or that you have any concerns or interventions you might want support with. And our pastoral lead from college also visits Fairfield Hospital to add further support. We're going to send you out a pack and that will enclose um, pre-employment checks from the NHS. So if this is something you're really thinking about for your student, then we ask you to fill those in. We've then got on Thursday the 4th of June at 2pm, a Q&A session regarding um, any questions that you might want to ask about the Fairfield internship to the team. If you have any questions in the meantime, please don't hesitate to contact me. My email is farmworth.e at elmsbank.co.uk or alternatively you can speak to the, your regular farm teacher that contacts and let me know any questions by then. Thank you. Hello, my name's Rachel Rose. I'm the tutor at the supported internship. I'm based at Fairfield General Hospital. Um, part of my role is to teach the Open Awards accreditation. Um, this type of work centres around work skills, so things like communication, working as a team, uh, preparation for work, and it also focuses on life skills, things like budgeting, problem solving skills, so it's a really useful accreditation. The students are with me twice a day, so firstly as they arrive in the morning, um, I'm there to meet and greet them, and then we work on our accreditation. And also in the afternoon, um, we also have a catch up, we see how the day's gone, um, work around any issues that may have arisen that day, and we also catch up on some work that we may have started in the morning. Um, within my role as well, it's a combined role, I also act as a job coach, so I'm also providing one-to-one um, -one support sometimes, sometimes within a group. It's very much bespoke and depends on what the student needs. Um, I'm also a key link to the school, so pastorally I still link in with the school every day and we can still provide support from Elms Bank. Hi everyone, my name's Lee Jones and if you're watching this you'll apply for this year's Supported Internship Programme based at Fairfield Hospital. My role on the programme is that of Senior Employment Officer and I'm responsible for ensuring that you're matched to a suitable placement and that you're making steady progress and that we're getting you to the stage where you can secure paid work. On the first year of our programme, six out of seven students did actually secure paid work so it's something that I'm expecting we can repeat in the programme this year. The first set of placements will always be based at the hospital. This gives us a, a, a baseline assessment of, of where you are, what your support requirements are and will allow us then to build a bespoke package of support tailored to your individual wants and needs. Really looking forward to meeting you all soon for the assessments and hopefully then again in September when the programme starts. In the meantime, um, enjoy your summer, stay safe, stay alert, um, over and out. Thank you.